This video is brought to you by Squarespace. Whether you need a new site, a new domain, or a new online store, make it with Squarespace. Yo, how's it going guys? Welcome back to another video. AirPods 2 said to finally be in production and a red version of the iPhone XS said to be making its way to shelves by the end of the month, at least in China. But I have a feeling it's gonna be coming globally as well. So if you're excited for this news, I wanna talk about two fresh reports today. Drop a like down below, always helps me out, and hit subscribe so you stay up to date on the latest Apple news. But let's go ahead and jump in. Covering AirPods has been so, so confusing because one day we've heard they're coming next week. The next day we hear they're coming in fall 2019. The next day we hear they're delayed or canceled. And today is not any of those days. Uh, today is a really good day because a new report from Economic Daily News, a Chinese publication, cites that not only are AirPods 2 in production, so Apple is actively producing these with a manufacturer uh, over East, but they are coming in spring of 2019, which is the season we're about to enter. Apple's holding an event on March 25th that there's not supposed to be new AirPods or new products at, but it's a very good sign to hear that AirPods 2 are going to be coming sooner rather than than later. But the report goes on to actually cite a little bit more detail about AirPods 2, corroborating some details that I know you guys are looking forward to. Number one, a new color option is coming. In addition to white, AirPods 2 are gonna be available in a beautiful mattish black colorway due to a new coating that Apple's gonna be putting on AirPods 2. Again, that's something we first heard in the My Smart Price report about a week ago. We're hearing it again now, and these appear to be two independent publications reporting the same thing, which is good news. Like it means AirPods 2, we're going to be able to probably rock in black with a super fresh new coating. Let me know down below in the comment section whether or not you guys are picking AirPods 2 up because I know a lot of us already have AirPods 1 and AirPods 2. We'll have to wait and see all the features that they're said to have, but hands-free Siri functionality, supposedly better bass, a new material, a new color. They're sounding pretty good to me so far. And now that they're in production, hopefully coming sooner this spring rather than later in the fall as OnLeaks had previously suggested. And for all of you AirPower holdouts out there, myself included, Apple's wireless multi-device simultaneous charging mat, uh, that's said to be launching in spring alongside AirPods 2 as well, which is dope because we've actually been waiting on that product for, we're getting close to the two year mark now and we still don't have it. I don't even know if you guys care about it, but if you do, AirPods 2 and AirPower and the AirPods wireless charging case are said to be launching at around the same time sometime this spring. It's just probably not gonna be at the Apple March event. It's probably going to be uh, through press releases later in, in the month of March or April. It's still sort of unclear. All right, now moving on from that is a, a much more unverified, unconfirmed rumor. While two sources now have reported that AirPods 2 are getting this new coating, this new colorway, that they are coming this spring sometime, this second source is someone that posted on Weibo, a Chinese social networking site, and basically said something really exciting, that Apple in China is going to be releasing a special red version of the iPhone XS. And they're gonna release it not like sometime in March or April per usual as they did in 2017 or 2018, but the source claims that this red iPhone XS that could look like this based on a concept that I created is gonna be on store shelves before the end of the month. It's one of those rumors that I want to be true, but but looking at the surrounding details, it's from an unverified user. It's said to be happening in less than 15 days. The, the product would actually be on store shelves. and. Then it would only be happening in China, which Apple does need to pick up iPhone sales in China. That's definitely been one of their biggest markets that's been hurt lately because nobody's buying iPhones there because they are super, super expensive. So to spur some purchasing, according to this post, uh, Apple is going to release a new China red color variant. I, and I hope that this comes everywhere. I hope it doesn't just come to China because I'll definitely want to get my hands on a red iPhone XS. It seems like it would make sense for Apple across the board to launch a red iPhone because they've done it for the past two years. Why would they not do it this year? But I just don't know if it's gonna be coming in February or if we're gonna see it sometime in March or April as, as we have traditionally. Just seems a little bit early for me. At the same time, Apple stock has kind of been hurting in recent months, so maybe Apple's doing that sooner rather than later approach to hopefully spur more people to buy an iPhone. But I also don't know if that argument works. Have you guys ever bought an iPhone just because of the new red colorway. I mean, I buy it to review it, but I'm also a YouTuber, so it's my job. I don't know if I've ever met anyone who's actually like, oh, I've been waiting to buy this iPhone because red's out now. 
I don't know if that's an argument that actually holds up, but I think that's sort of what Apple thinks. I'm a huge fan of the red iPhone XS, but I'm also a huge fan of Squarespace, who was kind enough to sponsor today's video. I have a really strange addiction to buying domain names, and I think it's really fun to like have your own little spot on the internet. And Squarespace makes that super easy, and on top of that, they have 24-7 award-winning support to help you along the way, or if you run into issues, but also these amazing, super good-looking templates to apply on top of your website to make everything pop and look like someone professionally made it. Right now, if you go to squarespace.com slash iUpdate, you not only get to start a free trial, but you get 10% off your first purchase, which is super dope. So go ahead and check them out. I'll leave a link down below. All right, guys, so that is all the Apple news that I wanted to share with you today. If you learned something new, as always, drop a like down below. It always helps me out and hit subscribe so you stay up to date on the latest Apple news. If we hear anything else in the coming days about the red iPhone or, of course, AirPods 2, I will be sure to be the first to update you here on YouTube. But that's all I've got for you now. Thanks for watching. I've been Sam, and I'll catch you guys in my next video.